hello my people welcome back to our another video guys this video is about faq sigma y rank math seo plugin in this tutorial i will show you how to add faq sigma in your articles or in your wordpress post that's really easy guys if we talk about faq sigma if you're going to search anything in google like our services or website designing and you will see some FAQ here downside people also ask these all are FAQ Sigmas in this tutorial we will go through step by step how to set up FAQ Sigma how to create um, FAQ Sigma directly in your WordPress post or articles okay so let's get start this tutorial please like share and subscribe my YouTube channel I really appreciate that so okay before we start this video here the basic setting about uh, sigma is here in the rank math seo plugin you have to visit click on dashboard when you click on dashboard scroll down to sigma structure data you have to enable this option okay we let's check some settings as well in single post title and we have some default values but if you want to change you can change this value what I would recommend these are default value and the default sigma is set to articles okay so let's get uh, to the next step how to add our FAQ sigma in our pages let me open click on all pages let me show you these all are my WordPress uh, service pages as I'm running digital marketing agency in so I need to add some FAQ sigmas in in our service page or an about us page so directly when someone going to search about our company or about us they will also see those questions like who we are um, uh, uh, what services we offer some related question we uh, we think uh, our our customer or clients might search on Google so we have to keep focus we have to uh, firstly create all our FAQs uh, questions and answers very properly or you can you also can write on paper uh, or anywhere in the docs uh, Google Docs keep your FAQs ready before we uh, start putting those in our WordPress post, WordPress page. Okay, so this is my about us page. If I open my about us page right now, this looks very simple without any FAQ there. As you can see, about us page is uh, complete detail about our company, who we are, why pretty, why they should choose us, and some. Uh, contact us button and we don't have any FAQ here but what I want here to add some FAQ so people will able to um, search directly in Google if they search about um, in the Google up a pretext services about us page and they will see some FAQs we add here okay so we have two ways to add Sigma let me go with first way if you're using Elementor, if you're if you're using Guntimag, as uh, the the process is very similar here. I will review with both of those editors. Okay, so here let's go with first basic WordPress editor or Guntimag. We have to check the plus option here. Toggle block inserter. We have to insert FAQ block somewhere here we want to display our FAQ questions right so we will click on add button and we have scrolled down to the end and we will see FAQ section uh, sorry rank math section let me scroll down and here it is rank math section we have table of content we have FAQ by rank math this is what we need or how to by rank math okay sigma by rank math okay 
let's go with FAQ we need to add FAQ some some FAQ here in our page so what we do we we can directly uh, insert our block somewhere if we want to uh, for example if we if we want to add our FAQ under under this section uh, contact us we want to add here first what we will do I have to get my basic title or button let me go with my uh, text here I drop here and I name it um, FAQ FAQ and I let me make it center okay let me make it center okay perfect now let's go back to the add block or you can search directly search here FAQ and you will see FAQ by rank mark let me drag it under FAQ here perfect okay now as I advised earlier please keep all your question and answer ready so here I'm using uh, my chat GPT and I have already some questions let me copy my first title okay let me go back here question let me paste my question okay this is our question sorry for that let me bring it to the down here under FAQ yeah perfect okay now I have already paste my title let's uh, also provide my answer okay answer here we have also option to add image if you want to add image in FAQ you just have to simply click on add image select your image make sure you provide all text title caption you also can use generate alt by rank math okay now we have also the image here okay so we want to add more questions just keep add new FAQ okay keep provide your answers and question let me add one more question here okay and answer as well then we will check our website how it look like okay we have two questions now let me update my page okay let's check out our website now scroll down under FAQ option here we have two FAQ here okay the next way to add FAQ Sigma in our page okay so we are on our same page here in editor what we will do here we will open rank math option the red icon here you can see my mouse where we add our title description sigma option is also here we have to uh, check you can edit snippet to check the title descriptions as well and then we have to go to next option to the sigma option you will see number three option number two is advanced and number three is sigma okay as I have already only one sigma if you are using uh, if you are, are working on articles or any blog posts then we have sigma article sigma here but we need FAQ sigma right so what we will do we will sigma generated click on it and here we will choose FAQ sigma this one okay and the other way if you already have template for example I already have this template FAQ template uh, why we need FAQ template or sigma templates actually um, if your website has some multiple pages and you want to pr uh, provide same schema like same answer same question and you save it to your uh, FAQ schema templates here let me show you if you go to rank math you will see schema templates in your case you might not have any schema template here 
you can build Sigma template by clicking add new Sigma. Okay, and you can add from multiple options you have depends on your website niche. Uh, if you're offering course, then you can choose course. If you have appointment or book, you can choose that Sigma multiple. For example, in my case, I'm uh, offering website or services. I will I can go with services then provide detail. Okay, let's choose FAQ for now. Provide name title. What title you want to provide for this particular FAQ Sigma and the short code. Uh, they have provide you short code here. You just only have to paste this short code on your on your WordPress. Let me show you here on your WordPress page or post. Scroll down and you can search for ad block short code. Okay, short code. Bring your short code, drag it where you want to add that particular code. Let me paste my ad here. Uh, sorry for that. Okay, if you want to add th th this particular Sigma shortcode, it will provide you this code. Okay, make sure before you uh, uh, publishing this code, you have to add all the questions by adding property group one by one. You have to provide question if you want URL, image, and answer. Okay. And you can also again click and keep providing question answers. Once you done this process, copy your short code. Copy short code. For example, here I have one question. Let me pick any question here. Okay. Question and uh, I have description. okay description here in answer make sure you provide up to 200 character which uh, google recommend for the answers faq sigmas okay let me delete question number two we will go with first question number one for now okay so here if you want to add image you have to provide image url here or your page url okay so we have add one uh, FAQ, Sigma, uh, FAQ question here. Let me click on save. Okay, before you click on save, after you click on save, you have to copy this short code where you want to show these questions. How many questions you want to add? You can add multiple like five questions, ten questions, and those will be displayed in your pages or post with a single short code. If I provide that short code here and I update and you will see downside we will have another sigma question like that okay this question we add in the template right that's why it's showing duplicate okay here because in this in the template we provide same question okay but i want to show different question here in the template i if i set other question for example, how long it take to design a website? It will be my question and this will be my description. Okay, I change it. Click save. Now if I refresh my website, you will see that question here. Okay, how long it take website? Because it will automatic update once you update in your Sigma template here okay click save so now you have one FAQ Sigma as I already earlier create this one so I will go with only one okay perfect now if you want to change or add some more questions it's very simple you have to just add it that particular FAQ Sigma and uh, keep add your question or change your question you just only need one single chart code, okay to to provide the another way here uh, when you click on this rank math icon here number three as I earlier explained Sigma Sigma generator click on it we all again choose FAQ here and you can go with one by one question adding question once you provide all the question like one question and this is the same process 
we done in FAQ template okay if you want in a single particular page or single post uh, then you can choose this one but if you want to display as a template or in multiple pages you need that particular shortcode for the single this is for the single uh, single page okay provide the question let me provide question and the answer okay perfect okay now save it for post and you will see schema in use also article and fake okay that's all that's all but if you only configure sigma markup for your page sigma search engine use structured data to display you can use uh, structured data or here sigma in use you can provide those questions here if you don't want to display directly in the in the in the page or if you if you only want them to have display in the google search system you can provide fq sigma here in the options okay but if you have a service business or other niche website you want to display some question answering then i will recommend you can go with rank math faq sigma option okay you can either go with the block to add block search for faq and you will see faq by rank math or you can use this short code okay if you if you want to go with faq's template this one templates then you have to first uh, pro write add new sigma and provide all the FAQ questions you have to follow all the step then copy your short code where you want to display only one short code enough for you and that will dis start displaying question in the page as well okay so if you want ask up regarding FAQ sigmas or any other information regarding that you can leave comment in the description uh, but if you are looking for rank math pro discount you can check link in description with that link you will get nice discount some extra ai credits lot more features so i hope you like this video thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate love you guys